Well, temperatures this morning sitting in the 40s. When you factor in the wind, though, it feels like those low 30s. That wind still gusty out of the north northeast at 15 miles per hour. In Florence, 36 degrees. You feel like temperature at 30. More reason to grab the jacket as you're stepping out the door. And in Conway, that feel like finally dipping into the 20s. Winds out of the north air at Coastal Carolina. Once again, a nice chill in the air. It's the coldest morning this week. Kids heading off to school once again, going to need the jacket. And honestly, probably going to need the jacket by the time they get off the bus as well. Temperatures at 60 this afternoon. Partly cloudy skies. As we go throughout the week, we'll begin to see clouds increase. It's going to be ahead of that next weather maker that comes in for Wednesday and Thursday. It's going to be Wednesday afternoon for the best chance of rain into Thursday morning. I think most of that holds off though throughout until Thursday and let's show you why uh, the front going to be off to our west. By the time you wake up on Wednesday, clouds will be around as well. But by the time we head into the afternoon, this front begins to stall out right over top of the Carolinas. And what's going to happen is as we go into Wednesday night, we'll finally begin to see that rain enter into the area. That rain will continue uh, to fall throughout overnight Wednesday into Thursday morning. While that's happening, a developing low pressure will begin to get its act together and try to force this not only to turn a little bit heavier in the rain, but finally get the rain out of here. And you'll notice throughout the day Thursday, it's a good soaking rain from sun up to sundown. So really scattered showers arrive Wednesday night into the afternoon and evening. Like we talked about, the showers turned widespread overnight and into most of your Thursday. I think when all is said and done, one to three inches of rain expected, a few storms, and yeah, some heavy downpours can't be ruled out as we go into your Thursday. A good amount of rain. I would say the average right now, one to three inches. Isolated spots of three inches plus can't be ruled out when all is said and done. The good news is because this is happening for the middle of the week, we give you the first alert to our first weekend with no rain chances in six weekends here. 66 on Friday will warm up as we head into Saturday and for Easter Sunday temperatures in the mid 70s for the beaches. How about upper 70s as you move inland? And like we said, no rain in the forecast for any of your weekend plans, uh, which is a good change of pace.